Uh, next up we have uh, Willie Rennie from the Liberal Democrats. Now I must get special bonus points for being the only politician with lycra today. Can I thank um, the Muddy Riders and the Fife Feeder Group who cycled in with me from Inverkeven this morning. It made it much safer to be in greater numbers on that route in. Also, thank you to the Scottish Government and to Edinburgh Council for investing in the Dalmeny improvement on the A90, which again made it much safer. I think that's a big improvement for those coming in from Fife. What I think we need to make sure, and this is where organic events like this, where the bottom-up pressure on government keeps even more pressure on the Scottish Government to invest increasing amounts every year. And my pledge is to keep on asking Derek Mackay to live up to his commitment that he's made today. We've, in the Liberal Democrats, put as our top priority in the budget every year active travel. A specific amount increased on active travel every single year. We will keep on doing that because we do need to invest in the infrastructure. But we also need to change the culture. I've just been speaking to a lady from Kirkcaldy who says we need to, and this is where everybody's got a responsibility, not just the politicians in government, but we all need to tell every driver in the country to think about the cyclists. Whenever you get the opportunity, whenever you get the chance to say to them, think about us, that we are unprotected, we don't have the metal box around us to protect us, that we need you to think about us when we're on the roads. That culture change is essential in addition to the infrastructure improvement. So thank you to everybody who's come today. Your voice is being heard in the Parliament. It does have an effect. And every single year when we're discussing the budget, I can pledge to you that we will continue to make it a priority. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.